Hello, Melissa here at Crescent Moon Tarot doing day 19 of Tarot Mama's Back to School Challenge. And today's question from the imaginary querent is, my business partners and I have stopped seeing eye to eye. Not really a question, but I'm just gonna shuffle a couple cards and see what comes out. And I'm using my Zerner Farber deck. And I'm doing a, just gonna do a three card draw. that card out sometimes whenever I'm shuffling if a card like that will flip out jump out fall out or whatever um, I will use that in the reading all right I'm just gonna pull two more we got four swords in reverse and two of hearts in reverse. So two of hearts in reverse, I'm just gonna go ahead and start with that. That tells me that there could be uh, kind of too many hands in the pot. It may be beneficial to, there we go, now we're focused. It may be beneficial to kind of um, sit down, grab a piece of paper and look at who is doing what and make sure that it's clearly defined whose responsibility it is to do what. Um, I know in my place of business, we're a very small organization, and the lines can sometimes get a little blurred. Um, in fact, I, I myself recently realized I was doing a whole lot of things that aren't in my job title or job description. I'm supposed to be customer care, and I've been invoicing and doing statements, um, which is what accounting should be and not what I should be doing. So if you're not seeing eye to eye with your with your business partners, perhaps sit down, write down everything that you do, everything that they do, and see if any um, lines, for lack of a better word, any borders need to be redrawn and um, perhaps divvy up the responsibilities maybe a little more evenly. And then we have the Four of Swords in reverse which tells me that resting is not really um, not really going to happen right now. There's a lot of work to be done. Um, it, it's This card is really here just to kind of emphasize that it is an uphill battle, and there's still a lot more to go, a lot further way to go, and it's, it's not going to be easy, especially if you're in a business or a venture that is very young and still in its infancy. There may not be a lot of checks and balances in place yet. There may not be a lot of organization yet, due process, things like that. In a new company or a, um, a young organization will not have those kinds of fail-safes in place yet. And it can feel a little disorganized sometimes, and that can be really, really stressful. So this card is here it's just to kind of reinforce that. It's an uphill battle, but in the end, it will be worth it. And then we have, ultimately, the card that fell out. I feel like this card is really important. We have the Hermit in reverse. It is important to listen to your business partners. You are all equals. No one is better than the other. And see if they have any wisdom that you can glean from them. And it is definitely a time to not be a hermit. Don't close yourself away. Don't retreat. Don't step back and let somebody else, you know, kind of take the spotlight and start running the show. Maintain the sense of equality amongst your partners and make sure that everybody is on the same page. Don't start backing away or stepping away just yet. It's not time to bow out.